Video has become the most common way to consume content. In fact, you're doing that right now by watching this video and trust that your clients are waiting for you to do the same thing. In this video, I'm going to share with you some game-changing software that's going to help you create video in minutes. Hey, it's Jaime with Echo Real Estate Advisors. Welcome to the channel that provides actionable content to help your business grow. Don't forget to subscribe as every month I give away one of my Facebook, Google, and YouTube courses away for free as a thank you for being a subscriber. You've heard it said many, many times, including in this channel, do more video. But oftentimes, the limitations present themselves and those limitations can be anywhere from i don't have time i'm not techy enough i don't know what to say i don't want to be on that side of the camera i can be behind it and and shoot this amazing video but i do not want to be in front of it a lot of those limitations present themselves but in reality it is much more simpler than you realize now in today's video, we're gonna cover a very cool software known as InVideo. So InVideo is a software that I've been using for a few weeks now, and when I say it's game changer, I really do mean that. It is a game changer, not only in the way that I've seen video be uh, packaged or repackaged or edited, because I've had to learn from the ground up to where I, I used to be a, one shot type of a person where regardless of how crappy my video was, I would just do that in one shot because I dreaded doing editing. But as I've advanced, especially more in this YouTube, um, let's just call it a career <laughs> in this YouTube world, I've needed to learn editing and I've learned it the hard way where you know it's trial by fire for figuring it out yourself and ultimately now I am producing in Final Cut Pro. It may not be the best, but I'm learning as I go along. However, having gone through in video, which we're gonna see today, I wish I would've had this. <laughs> I wish I would've had this when I started, and I am actually using that in my business today because I am not a savant. I, in the Final Cut Pro or Premiere, um, uh, Premiere Editor, or any type of complicated editing, that's just not me. So in video, I am using that in my business today and I'll share with you, if you stay to the end, I'm gonna share with you exactly how to do that as a real estate agent. All right, option one, you're gonna see that convert your script to video. You're gonna find here that it is a, if you have a lot of substance, a lot of words in your messaging what you want to convey via video this is going to be a good option for you it's convert your script to a video as it says now if you want to go and this is where a lot of people will end up going if you want to go into a more um, thematic a more cinematic type of video this is where you're going to end up doing it in option two you're going to see here it's ready-made versatile templates create promos uh, product videos, video ads, social videos, and more. This is where you're gonna find, you're gonna spend the, maybe 90% of your time. Now, yes, if you're a blogger, if you have a lot of uh, words, uh, articles that you're wanting to present and articulate, then you're gonna find yourself on option one, but for the majority of what you're doing, you're gonna find yourself in option two producing there, and then you're gonna find the build your own video this you start from scratch it's a blank canvas and really you're going to find yourself here two percent of the time now i know being a full-time realtor as well i know us i know us realtors and we want things to work we want them to work quickly and we want to go on to either list that house or put a buyer under contract we want all of that fun stuff so this isn't your profession and i understand that so i can confidently say that building your own video is not going to be on your radar as much you're going to start with a ready-made template 
All right, so we went on that first option. Remember, this is more text-based. This is more article-based. This is more blog. This is a written word type of messaging. And you're going to see right off the bat, it's very simple to digest. So you're going to see first step towards building a great video. You're going to very, very, very quick um, uh, preview. You're going to see that on every single one. So you're going to do... We're just gonna go through the templates. Again, this video is more to present to you kind of what it is, introduction of where where to go and why to, why to go there and, and give you some reasons of why I think this is a superior product versus every, every other product out there. So you can see here, you can click on it. Let's see, reduce that volume. You can choose the format. And you're going to start seeing a lot of the same vibes a lot that Canva has. So you're going to see a lot of Canva vibes, we're going to call that. It's laid out very similar in, in full disclosure. So you see the, um, the buttons kind of um, mirror each other. But really what highlighted Canva or really made Canva what it is, it's those formattings. And the format that you can produce here and that you can select from here is a, a big reason why I was sold on in video. I'm able to produce the video format without me knowing anything on the back end on how to do that. I just look, I, I have certain things that I want to articulate in that video and the images that I want to use and I want to download and I want to forget about it. I don't want to figure out, even though I have to do this on Final Cut Pro, I don't have to, I don't want to have to figure out how to get this transition. This looks easy, very, very easy, because I thought the same thing. This looks very easy to do, but it really isn't. Okay, we can go over templates for days, but considering that, as mentioned, this video is more of an introduction, more of an overview, so you see what in video is and what the opportunity is to create videos, I am just going to leave with you, leave you with why I decided to go with in video over as mentioned videos is one that I would use and some other videos that some other video creators that I ended up going with this over the other. So the reason the first reason was images. The images that are included in this package or in this software is incredible. I don't know which image um, companies they are, I don't know if this is, um, what is it, iStock or uh, Getty Images or all of the big players in the space. I don't know which one they're tied into, but I haven't run out of ideas yet. And then the video, the B-roll that I'm able to create and Im embed into these videos is just crazy. So I absolutely li love that feature. Then you have music. It introduces music that you can actually listen to. It's not the gimmicky, singy, songy image, uh, music that you see whenever you create a listing video through your MLS. I don't know if you've ever tried that. I think it's a panorama, something like that, at least in my MLS, where it takes the images that I that I created and it just does a slideshow and over overlays some very gimmicky music that just stinks. So... The music aspect was super cool. The templates, this was a game changer for me in the sense of that I am able to, whenever I drop a new episode, I just clip a section of the video here, do that over here, and then the background is a different video. I'll put that on Instagram and I'm ready to go. So that aspect of the templates was super cool. The specifications, again, I just mentioned you can... Um, separate this based off of Instagram, based off of ads, based off of YouTube, whatever uh, whatever platform you're trying to get onto, you just select that. And whatever you slot in is going to work. You don't have to go through a full production and then try to figure out, oh, well, this word that I'm trying to fit in here, will it work whenever the video is showing upright? Will it show on Snapchat? Don't have to worry about that. The specifications is on point on point the flexibility of in video has really helped me just create different types of videos and actually i before we sign off i want to show you what the, i mean a video that i produced on it and i'll be uploading 
into my YouTube channel some of the videos that I produce from here because I do like the quality. I do like the ease of use and a lot more, it pr presents a lot more options for me to put them on Facebook, put them on LinkedIn, where as you see, based off of this video, I'm long-winded. So my the videos that I make may not always hit that 10 minute mark that uh, LinkedIn likes. So if it's above 10 minutes, then I can't organically put this video on LinkedIn. There is no, um, there's gonna be no issue with that, with these types of videos. So I wanna share with you a video that this probably took me 10, 10 minutes is too much. Let's just call it 10. It, it took me 10 minutes to create. So check this out. So it's top uh, places to live in Texas. Now look at all of the animations. If you've ever edited anything in your life, you see that this is not that simple. <laughs> it's not that simple to do, regardless if you're using Final Cut, or Final Cut or Premiere or any other fancy editing software, you know that these aren't that easy to do. But for me to do it in less than 10 minutes, 10 minutes is um, astounding for me, even though um, I can edit a little bit now, it's still, it was still a good return of investment in, in time because I didn't have to throw this over to Fiverr. I didn't have to get somebody from Upwork. This is something that I pieced together. If you notice, this isn't even my content. <laughs> this is niche, um, the, uh, the rating system, the, that this is all of their content, which I do source in the, or cite in the video. So they get credit, but this is something that stands out. It creates, I don't want to say polarity, but it creates conversation where, okay, what well, number two was wrong, or why would Plano be that high? Why would Richardson be that high? Or if you're curious, the Woodlands was actually the winner in this, um, in this ranking. So it provides some content, and this is something that you can do very, very quickly. Okay, now, as I promised, the type of content that you as a real estate agent need to be producing right now, even if it's not within video, which I highly suggest that it is, but even if it's not within video, you can produce listing videos. I know I mentioned and gave a little bit of a hard time to the MLS that provides us that flexibility right now with, um, again, it's, I think it's Panorama, I can't remember exactly, but you can do listing videos in a different way, in a dynamic way where it's not a slideshow. You can do market updates, do the monthly market updates regardless of how you do it. I've seen some people write it out on a whiteboard and then do the presentation. I've seen some people read it off a teleprompter and try to get that right, try to get those numbers just correct. I've seen some people do this same similar style that I'm doing right now where you have the talking head at the bottom and then you're presenting something off of a PowerPoint. But if you can create something that's dynamic, something like this, I'm not saying I'm gonna win a video award for this, but I am at least gonna be out there. I'm at least going to be um, presenting something of value month in and month out where I don't have to spend an hour, two hours, three hours, however long it takes those people to produce that market update. So that's the second type of content that you as an agent can can produce. And then the third is top reasons to videos. So what does that mean? Top reasons to buy new builds. Top reasons to buy now. Top reasons to sell now. That may have been a, a bad example. I don't want you to induce selling or <laughs> create a, uh, a panic or anything like that. I think there's actually a law against that in Texas. So. Anyway, those are the types of content that you can produce with video. It's a very plug and play 
type of software that it just works. If you followed this channel with any regularity, you know that I'm a big fan of taking action, so taking immediate action, and a big fan of free. Fortunately, that is exactly what you get with InVideo. If you use the link down below, you'll be shot straight over to InVideo, and then you can sign up for free. You can sign up for their free plan, which will give you, I believe, five videos. It won't have as many features as you saw today, but it'll get you started and you're able to check out the platform to see if it's the right fit for you, which I will suggest that it probably will be if you use it with regularity and are out there really invested in video because again, it's a platform like no other. There's no need for you to learn how to code. There's no need for you to learn how to edit or anything else like that. So you're gonna wanna check it out. In the future, when you use the link down below, you will have access to discounts. So that is something that I um, that I am very appreciative for the company to offer that to my audience. Again, you would have to use the link down below. In addition to those benefits right there of getting a discount, if you sign up through my link, I will actually send you the cheat sheet of video content that our realtors should be using. So it's uh, beyond the ideas that I just presented of listing videos, market updates, or top reasons for or top reasons to type of a content. That um, the cheat sheet that I have, I will make that available to you for free. As soon as you sign up, just shoot me an email, which will be showing somewhere around here shoot me an email, let me know that you've signed up and I will gladly make that available to you.